okay right so so uh, like sometimes it happens like uh, like uh, I I am giving interviews and I am serving my two month notice period and I have completed only one week of ser- notice period okay and uh, I got offer from some big company which I don't want to miss out and they are asking me to join within month within month and my my current company is not ready to uh, leave me before two months before serving uh, two months of notice period in that condition what should i do should i leave my current company directly without serving the complete notice period and join that bigger company uh, which which is See, my dream company okay so in this scenario what you can do is first you have to connect with the hr okay the uh, after you have like put down your papers you have to just go and connect with her and you have to tell her you have to ask her the question like do we have uh, any buyout option okay like i can opt for if you have any buyout option then please go ahead and you can opt for it if you really feel that that company uh is my dream you want to join that yeah, yeah and you want to actually join that company you don't want to miss it out so in this scenario you can actually uh, directly go and ask so how that, uh, why do i have a how why out works because some people might not aware about uh, what is a buy out and how it works the uh, buy out is like when you serving notice period of 2 months you get paid for 2 months yeah okay now you are serving only 1 month notice period and the next month you have a joining there yeah. so you are taking the whole month buy out yeah. means you uh, the salary which you are getting in that amount in that month you will not get okay right okay but you will get in fnf when you joining your new company you can share those details and you will get that amount okay in the new company because you are buying out to join in that company okay. so buyout works in this way so new it is not only like only of a month or something it is like of 15 days of 45 days you have for 2 months people of whose a uh, notice period are of 90 days they opt for 2 months buyout okay so new company will be offering me that 2 months of salary for free of cost without working some uh, see how this works is like you have lost that amount right yeah yeah when you give those slips and when you ask your current organization where you have joined you tell them see i for joining this company i have taken a buyout option mm-hmm. so uh, what are you going to do how are you going to compensate me in this mm-hmm. so they will definitely they'll check the amount and they will go ahead with it okay and suppose my current company is not uh, not having the buyout option and i want to join my dream company who is forcing me to join within month so in that case uh, if i leave my current company without serving two month of notice period uh, will will it uh, cause a problem in the future yeah definitely in your bgv it will cause okay and if i trans- so uh, see what hap- what happens is like when you're stressing more when your dream company is actually stressing more on joining within a month yeah. the best option what you can do is you you just write a mail to them yeah okay to your dream company see i have tried my level best over here mm-hmm. but i don't have any uh, as i mentioned you in early conversation it said that i don't have any buyout option or negotiation on this on my notice period uh, and i will be joining you guys on these date and i would really appreciate if you can consider this okay when the company is actually stressing uh, stressing more or else you can actually directly talk to hr mhm okay. because uh, when once you talk to hr and you explain the whole scenario to them no so they just tell you to just drop a mail but mm-hmm. in their head it will be there yeah this person is going to join because you are giving the assurance that i am ready to join but my current organization is not leaving me right 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 so you should give that assurance that see i am ready to join but this is the scenario so i wanted to discuss it with you cool okay got it now i understood it and uh, suppose my uh, that dream company has a uh, needs a immediate joiner 
and suppose i don't serve notice period i directly join them and they are ready to take me also because they they need me because uh, they uh, they need to develop some uh, new product or a startup product and they are paying uh, they are ready to pay well since they are a startup they don't have any problem with the verification and all uh, then sh- uh, then it will uh, cause a problem in the future companies in in the longer run see over here only it will cause a problem how come if your company is not re- give, ready to relieve you how how are you supposed to join some other company so is it not possible to directly leave uh, directly stop going in the current when you're leaving when you're directly leaving right mm-hmm. it gives a very ne- negative impact okay. to be honest with you see uh, when you're directly leaving without having a word and without even discussing and you mm-hmm. just left uh, mm-hmm. uh, you just submitted your laptop everything you left there and you just left the company and you have joined some other company mm-hmm. but this organization will not get rid of you they be like no you have to serve it because they have certain policies okay so- they be like you have to serve it and see people some people go for like they don't give their leaving letter okay they don't they don't clear their bgv some okay. companies does it okay. when can when the employee is actually taking a certain extreme step then some companies does it they they doesn't they don't clear their bgv they don't give them leaving letter their fnf is stuck okay okay and you need all these documents for your new company right 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 so okay. this the scenario uh and i think people shouldn't do this okay, because it is right. very difficult for them not for us yeah not for the hrs okay. it is actually difficult for them because uh you have a conversation with them make them understand mm-hmm. if they have a way out they will definitely help you out in this right 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 so, it is uh, it is very easy you know to communicate with people Yeah. and people actually should come openly and communicate what and all they are facing what they need from us right right 